hello again from the Hearts of War project. Uh, just uh, bringing the next in a series of videos looking at artifacts that um, we've recently received and are very happy to display here at the exhibition. Um, this particular one is really interesting, um, great history as well, in that it's a uh, German First World War sniper's plate, um, effectively an armour shield. And uh, as you can see from this one, it's uh, seen better days. It's actually got some battlefield damage on it. And uh, basically, it was uh, employed by people, um, by snipers, or it was actually built into a trench wall to create a loophole. You can see here that it's uh, it's got like an armor catch on top. The idea is that that's on a pivot on the reverse, and it can be spun around to cover over the, uh, the firing slot there. Um, it's obviously taken a bullet strike at some point or a piece of shrapnel and you can see there are actually two damage points one just there which has cracked it and the second which has taken a chunk off the top of the shield so we're actually looking at the direction that it would uh, face towards the enemy so this is the outer side you can see it's got a curved edge on either end to deflect any kind of shrapnel uh, or um, splinter uh, bullet splinters away from the uh, away from the defending uh, the defenders and uh, the idea was that this um, uh, vertical groove here would uh, be used to um, house a rifle and uh, at first glance it maybe looks like this isn't actually the right way that it should be but it is um, obviously some people tended to think that they went this way um, and it's kind of a, an obvious slot for your eyes but of course it's not the idea being that it was used by snipers and with a telescopic sight on top of your rifle you needed to be, a, uh, be able to see out of it so actually that's the correct way that, that it was uh, that it was used. Um, they could be used freestanding. They did have a, a catch on the end to, to put a, a sort of standing up leg on it so you could tilt it back at an angle and use it in a temporary position. But also more regularly it was built into, um, uh, built into a, a trench loophole or something like that. So uh, an original uh, German First World War sniper shield and a really lovely item, something that you don't see that often. Incredibly heavy, and a very thick, uh, very thick armor plate. The usually the um, individuals using this would also wear uh, a steel visor on top of their helmet, and occasionally a, a sniping chest or a breastplate as well. So a good amount of protection afforded. But a, a very nice first of all item that we're very pleased to have on display here. So there we go. Thanks.